Looking for the latest gist in the life of your favorite celebrities? Look no further. You are about to be served. This is NX Daily Top 5 Lifestyle. At number 5. Rapper Birdman wants to remove his face tattoos, says he's getting older. 50-year-old Brian Williams, best known for his stage name, Birdman, has made it known that he's looking for a way to remove his facial tattoos. He disclosed this during an interview on The Wendy Williams Show when he said that he's interested in removing the tattoos on his face. The Cash Money co-founder has at least 17 tattoos on his face, ranging from teardrops and a music note to a cross at the center of his forehead. Here is what he said and I quote, I didn't want to take the head tattoos off, but I want to take the facials off. And I was asking my partner, 50 cent because he removed his tattoos so i wanted to go to somebody who can take this tats off my face end of quote the desire to remove his facial tattoos is a replay of his march forbes interview when he went into more details by saying and i quote i just think at this point in my life i don't need that that stereotypes you it takes away from the business and certain things end of quote he further explained during the interview that although he wants the removals done he's not opposed to it if it's not possible at number 4 I am lost without you. Nipsey's girlfriend and baby mama, Lauren London, pays tribute. Nipsey's longtime girlfriend, Lauren London, has finally broken a silence concerning the death of her lover. She wrote on Instagram, and I quote, I'm completely lost. I have lost my best friend. I have lost sanctuary, my protector, my soul. I'm lost without you. We are lost without you, babe. I have no words. End of quote. The model and actress had been in a five year relationship with the rapper and had a young son with him named Cross. They formed a tight knit family. Family with the son, Hustle's daughter from a previous relationship, and Cameron Carter, London's son with rapper Lil Wayne. The couple have been known as one of the genre's more enduring love stories. This is the very first social media post Lauren has shared since Nipsey was killed. At number 3, Yvonne Nelson threatens to sue anyone who writes negative things about her daughter, Ryan Roberts. Award-winning Ghanaian actress and mother, Yvonne Nelson, has threatened to sue anyone who speaks or writes anything negative about her daughter, Ryan Roberts. She took to social media to further strengthen the decision by saying and I quote, People wish bad for me and that is what I understand. People are so interested in the negative stuff and I'm used to the stories. But my worry is why they're interested in the negativity. You know people are wicked. Even if they hear the good things, they don't want to believe it. They won't write about the good things. As I have given birth, I have realized that people want to direct their issues to the child who hasn't done anything to them. I'm used to that, but sometimes it gets too much. Yvonne Nelson also said, She hasn't done anything to anyone. She's an innocent child. So as for me, that one, if you say anything bad, I can get offended. But with me, I understand because it comes with my job. End of quote. Art number two. Toto DK paid off people's debt and wants her money back. Controversial actress and mother of one Tonto DK makes the news again as she's upset that the same people whose debt she paid off are now giving negative opinions about her and she wishes she could take her money back from them. The actress settled the debts of 10 people. Hours later, she got into a social media spot with her ex-husband Olakunle Oladuni Churchill and some of her followers took her ex-husband's side. Tonto DK wishes she could get her money back from all the people she helped who are now speaking ill of her. Disappointed by the betrayal, she put up a post to pour out her mind. Here is what she wrote. The way I feel, everyone I paid their debt yesterday, in total 10 of you, I want my money back. End of quote. She further wrote, This is how I feel, but what will I gain aside a few millions back? SMH. But you all enjoy. Money isn't one of my problems. Hashtag, too many poor people with unbankable opinions. At number 1, David O prepares to perform at the Hot 97 Summer Jam in New York. Nigerian musician David Adeleke, better known with the stage name David O, is set to perform at the Hot 97 Summer Jam in New York. The jam is one of the biggest concerts held during the summer in the United States. The music star shared the news via his Instagram account where he posted a picture of the event's lineup. Other notable music stars set to perform at this year's Hot 97 Summer Jam are Cardi B, Mick Mill, Migos, Tony Lanez, a Boogie, Casanova, and a host of others. The event will be taking place at the MetLife Stadium in New York on Sunday, June 2nd, 2019. And that's it on NX Daily Top 5 Lifestyle. For this and more, follow us on all social media platforms at Nigeria's Extreme, and you can visit our website at www.nigeria.tv.